Resident Evil. Oh, you're back. Oh. <laughs> of course, I had to reload. But anyway, oh, you're back. And you're spitting again. That's great. Anyway, you guys are back. Oh my gosh. Um, no, hit A, not X. I'm gonna drop off those ink ribbons because I've got no reason to keep a uh, hold on them. But, uh, that definitely happened. Oh, I want to get rid of these two. Nah, I'll, I'll hold on to them for right now. Well, I guess there's no way, nowhere to go, but, uh, that deep, dark hole in the ground. Yay. I can't wait. Large man whose hands are tied hangs here. Oh! Is that the, uh, is that Alexander? It looks like him. Hmm. I wonder, did he really deserve the things that happened to him? Or are Alfred and Alexia just completely off their, off their rocker? I hear ya. I'm ready for ya. Haha! Take that, foul beast. Did I check this room? Yes, that is the fire extinguisher room, which I need to revisit. Yes. Of course, I don't know if it'll actually help me or not, but it can't hurt. Yeah, there we go. Now I can put out one fire. And I have a pretty good idea who might need that. All right, I think... Uh, I think I'm gonna try shooting it. Oh, uh, oh, uh, oh, uh. I lied. <laughs> I saw an opening. I tried going for it, then the opening closed. But I made it. None the worse for it. Alright. So let's just go straight ahead. <laughs> I don't have enough light to... to try anything else. Ooh. Seems like it'd be a bit chilly in here, Chris. Don't you want to, you know, put on another layer or something? No? Okay. I like the music change. I'm gonna heal up, because I saw the- I, I see the herbs, so... I'm already at caution, um, well, I mean, <laughs> already at caution. No, I did take quite a bit of damage, so. Okay. Switchboard on this floor. It's building up quite a bit. Oh. Well, if only we had something in the shape of an octagon. Too bad I didn't drop off everything after I, uh, we saw Alfred plummet to his death. Oh, and plenty of save stuff here. 
Wait, wait, wait. Let's get out an eight. <laughs> Let's get out the lighter so I don't miss anything else. Jeez. Ah, see, I would have completely missed these things. Not that I can carry them, but you know, I would have completely missed them. I'm gonna drop off the assault rifle. Actually, it doesn't seem to be doing me that much good. Plus, we just upgraded our Glock, and we haven't even gotten a chance to use that. Come on. I'm excited to see what it can finally do. Plus, we've got 150 bullets. I mean, come on, this is a bit ridiculous at this point. 169, never mind. I guess that's all for this room. And we've got a guy waiting for us in the other room, don't we? Oh, no, no. <laughs> Mixing up where we are. Oh, oh ho. <laughs> um, I'm going to try out the Glock. Might as well. Ooh, three shots. Oh, never mind, not three shots. This is actually getting a bit, uh, a bit of a, becoming a bit of a hairy situation. Uh, maybe on the last guy. Yeah, I'll, I'll use it on the last guy. Let's see. Nope, I can't shoot him in the head. Oh come on! I just want to play around with the weapons a little bit, see what's what's what. You need some, uh... You really should bundle up before going out in the cold like that, Chris. You'll catch your death of cold. <laughs> Seriously, this has got to be absolutely freezing and you're in a cutoff t-shirt. This is just like, am I just running a gauntlet or something at this point? Come on. This is a lot of zombies. And there's not really any way I can just run past them, so. Not that many, at least. I would not be surprised if there were more. Oh, okay. <laughs> Never mind. Oh. Well, that didn't help us that much. Was that a door over there? No. Well, only one place to go then. Gotta get that power connector. Let's hope I can hit him before he hits me. There we go. I think he's down. All right. Uh, yeah, he's good. All right, so. Oh. Wait, wait, where the heck are we? <laughs> Who had the time to like import all these bricks and do all this masonry, jeez. This looks like the area leading up to uh, Alexia's mansion on, or well, Alfred's mansion on top of the... Can I just step down here? No. Where did this guy even come from? He was totally in water, but... Was he that just that quick in getting around? guess so. Alright, so... Oh man, the Ferris wheel. Or not the Ferris wheel, the merry-go-round. I can't wait. The wing object. Oh! Are we building a dragonfly then? I, I guess so, because they like to pull the wings off of dragonflies. Yeah. Hints from the... Oh! 
Oh, I see. It's like uh, the area at the top of Alexia's uh, mansion. I just noticed the painted sky walls. <laughs> okay. Um, there we go. Anyway. Hello, Resident Evil 1. How are you doing? I'm doing pretty fine. <laughs> what the? <laughs> okay. Um, all right, I'm going to see you guys next time on Let's Blindly Play Resident Evil Code Veronica. <laughs> this is pretty much the spitting image of the Resident Evil 1 mansion, except that there should be a door here and those... Uh, balcony should come out to the front. So, yeah, gonna see you guys next time, and we'll go through this mansion, and... Oh, hello! Ah! How about, how about a lighter? No? <laughs> That'd be a terrible idea. Well, uh, well, we found Claire. Good thing I checked back here, I'd be looking for hours otherwise. Oh. All right, how much you want to bet that there is going to be a hallway? Oh. Ah, a biohazard symbol. Hmm, like this game. <laughs> it's just got Chris's face on it. But um, I was going to say how much you want to bet that there will be a hallway where dogs jump in the, through the windows. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It's a picture of twins and their father. Three weird holes open. They are at the boy's finger, the man's ear, and the girl's bosom. So we're looking for a ring, an earring, and a necklace. But just the way that that was said. Um, so yeah, uh, found this spitting image of the Resident Evil. Well, almost spitting. This very similar image of the Resident Evil 1 mansion in Code Veronica. And a combat knife. Oh, maybe that's how we free Claire. That's an idea. We gotta drop stuff off, by the way, because we found... somebody back here. And we gotta free her. And, uh, I'm guessing that's what the combat knife is, because last time I remember they gave me a combat knife, it was supposed to, uh... it was Resident Evil 2 to cut away the, uh... the spider's webs. So I'm guessing it's the same sort of dealio here, because I don't need a second combat knife. Nobody even needs a first combat knife, except for in the first game. And this game, I guess, too. For, like, the first five minutes. Anyway. Let's go pick that up. <laughs> well, let's go drop stuff off so we can pick that up. Uh, da, 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 da. and we got that, so. <laughs> da, da, da. Um, I'm gonna keep the shotgun for now, and I'm gonna drop these off because I can grab some herbs. I think. No, not an herb over there. There's an herb over here. Is that blue or green? It's blue, okay, so we'll leave that for now. I know there were two green herbs in the hallway, so I'll grab those while I'm here. Ah, three green herbs, actually. Or is this another blue? It is another blue. Okay. Should probably be combining the blue herbs with the two blue green herb mixtures that I keep doing, because doesn't that make a uh, full health herb pile? Don't correct me if it doesn't, I won't see the comment. <laughs> All right. Anyhow, let's go save our sister. Got my serious face on because we've got serious business to deal with. We're this close. So we just cut her out. 
and then leave on the Harrier jet, right? There's room for two people. Uh, Steve can stay. Chris doesn't know Steve. He doesn't care. And she's clearly asleep, so we can clearly just leave. And we'll be halfway to uh, South America before she's like, Oh, hey. Um, where's Steve? <laughs> I mean, I know he's not really someone you would approve of, Chris, but he's a decent enough guy. Yeah. Yeah, there we go. I was right. Good thing he's got surgeon-like precision. Claire. <laughs> Chris! I missed you so much. I know. But we have to get out of here. Not yet. We have to find Steve. Who's Steve? He's a boy who escaped from that island with me. But then a monster attacked us and we got separated. So that means Steve is still somewhere in this base? I'm sure of it. See, Steve, you're just a boy. She doesn't see you as a man. Where? What's wrong? I think... I think I've been poisoned. Just hold on. I'll be right back. Oh. Uh. Oh, I need serum. Okay, so it's... <laughs> it's a uh, Rebecca situation. Well, um... If this is anything like the mansion it resembles, there'll be a serum somewhere around here. Just as soon as I can find a way to... Oh. Um, who, how to break this to you, Claire? I think I'm out of options, actually. Uh, I don't know where to get serum, actually. All right, so, uh, yeah, on that, see you guys next time on Let's Blindly Play Resident Evil Code Veronica with Mio X Fu. Uh, see ya.